your favorite part of tour so far? My favorite part of tour has definitely been the fans getting to meet, you know, all the supporters and, you know, we do a meet and greet after the show where all the fans come out after and, and you know, so that's my favorite part because all the supporters that voted for us are, are here now and we get to meet them face to face. And what has been the loudest city so far? Uh, for me, it's been my hometown, uh, Hershey. Uh, that's because, you know, all the people that supported me throughout my entire career, even before Idol, you know, they all showed up. There were busloads of people. Just of you know, friends and fans that from my hometown that I had, and you know that was definitely the loudest for me. And the hardest part of the tour. The hardest part, I would have to say, you know, um, being in a different city every night is, is, is a little because I mean we get done late and then we, we leave and then head to another city, and I mean that's probably the hardest part. But I mean it's also one of the coolest things because you know we're in a different city. Uh, every day, so it's never the same place, you know, and it's something, you know, it's kind of a learning thing, you get to go to these cities and, and see what makes them really special, like New York City's Broadway shows, not many other places have, you know, that's what New York City, one of the things is famous for, and, and uh, Philly, the cheesesteak, so I mean, you, you know, you, you get to go to all these places and uh, you know, see what makes them, uh, or something special about them. And we have the nice hot weather here. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> well, the Rocky Mountains are absolutely beautiful. Yeah. So, I mean, it's really nice. I mean, back, back home, our mountains are covered in trees, so you don't actually see, you know, that much. And you come here, and I mean, they're just beautiful. And so, what has been one of your favorite songs to perform? Uh, on the tour? Yes. My favorite song to perform on tour is Walking in Memphis. I said that, um, you know, they always ask me what song I would love to perform on the show. And I said, Walking in Memphis. So, I mean, I'm happy that I get to perform it on tour. It's one of my favorites. And how much of the show do you get to actually watch? Uh, this show? Yeah. Um, other than my set, you know, uh, not really much of it. We can watch any set, but we have to be backstage so we're watching. And but I mean, we got to see everybody's set during rehearsals, and uh, you know, we did. Uh, we were in Auburn Hills, I think, was our first stop, and, and you know, we were there for a couple days actually, just playing out the show before we actually went out and did it. And so, I mean, we got to watch a little bit of everybody said. Hey guys, it's Erin, and I'm here with Tim from Mercado. Uh, yeah, that basically <laughs> sums it up. <laughs> so, first of all, what was your favorite part of being on this season? My favorite part of being on this season for me was actually just being there. Uh, since I got, I got sent home the last day of Hollywood week. And they called me back to be on the live show. So for me, just being there was so crazy. Um, that I really just couldn't get over that. That's, that was with me every week. And thinking that like you got sent home at the end of Hollywood week, and then you made it so far, what's that like? Oh man, it uh, it's a very very different perspective on everything. I feel. I mean, obviously, I don't know how everybody else, how what everybody else's process was because it was a little different than mine. Um, but having guys at home and then brought back, you just you realize how um, how quickly you can go. And then all of a sudden it was back, and like the opportunity was there again. It was, it was pretty wild. And what are your thoughts on all of the show format changing, basically, now? I don't even know what American Idol is going to look like next year. Um, I, honestly, I, don't, I have no idea what to expect. I, I, I know that the talent will still be, like, the, the, the contestants will still be there. And as long as there's really good contestants, then the show will, the show will be fine. You know, the show will be there because the contestants are really good. And it'll be interesting to see what, what kind of um, chemistry there is with the judges, with the new ones. I don't even know for sure who's going to be there um, and who's not. So I'm, I'm as curious as everybody else is. Okay. So with this tour, what has been your favorite city to play or what are you most looking forward to? Oh, favorite city to play? I kind of have to go with Dallas because that's where my family was. Um, that was the first time my, my parents had seen me on tour. Um, first time pretty much most of my family had seen me on tour, so it's my hometown. Dallas was a really good show, but I'm also really excited about Seattle, because that's where my family's originally from. I was born there, and uh, we moved down to Texas 15 years ago, so I'll, when I go back up there, I'll make, like, my grandparents will be there, and all my aunts and uncles and stuff, so that'll be a really good show as well. Okay, awesome. And so what's your favorite song to play every night? Oh, man. Honestly, it changes. My favorite song, it changes from night to night. Uh, the start of the tour, it was Viva La Viva. Uh, 
I love doing that song, and I still do. But then I've been working on Better Days and changing it up, and so and it's now to a point where I like I really enjoy singing Better Days every night as well. Um, and so now I'm going to start tweaking Viva La Vida a little bit more. Um, so I, honestly, for me, I just try to challenge myself with it every night and make small adjustments here and there so that it is new and fresh for me. Okay. And what do you think, like, what's the fan reaction been every night during meet and greets and things like that? Well, the fans have been incredible. They really have. I mean, even the ones that big old Casey James shirts or Lita Wise or Crystal, you know, everybody, like, they're so supportive of everyone, you know, because they realize that we all went through American Idol. We're all part of that incredibly unique experience. And so they've just been really, really supportive. Pretty, it's been pretty amazing. Okay. And how do you connect with them outside of the shows, like on Twitter and Facebook and things like that? I'm on Twitter. Uh, it's Tim Urban Music. That's my Twitter account. I'm on there pretty much every day. And uh, and then I'm also, I have a YouTube account. Uh, it's actually just Random Silence 2008. Weird, but that's it. Um, I'm on Facebook. It's uh, facebook.com slash turbanai9. Um, I've got a MySpace, just Tim Urban Music. And uh, that's it for now.